The Beach Bomber is finally in Fortnite. It was leaked in the 9.3 or update a couple weeks ago now, and it is finally here a day. And man, it is so good. The Bright Bomber is one of my favorite skins in the game. So when I saw this was coming out, I just had to buy it. I've been saving up my V-Bucks from Save the World. I've been grinding Save the World. Seriously, I've been grinding Save the World quite a lot to buy all these amazing 14 days of summer skins. I haven't spent a penny on 14 days of summer, and I've got myself a good majority of the skins, especially all the skins that I like from this event and the latest one being the beach bomber it might look so cool we've also got a brand new limited time mode today called storm chasers basically you're on a drift board and you've got a race again for storm it's 12 people in the game and it's basically the last one standing the last one to survive the storm wins the game and this is my first time playing it today i'm going to jump on and we're going to get ourselves a win on the very first game if you're excited for this make sure you give this video a big thumbs up if you're new around here make sure you subscribe your notifications on and as always if you're buying any skins in the fortnite item shop make sure that you're using code duels when doing so especially with the fact the beach bomber is out today if you haven't bought it yet you haven't got someone's code in you're going to buy it make sure you're using code doodles when you're doing so It'll really help trying to grow out a lot i use code doodles when buying beach bomber of course i did so make sure that you guys are as well without any further ado let's dive straight in the storm chase let's get ourselves the win let's do this right here we go it's time to play storms chases i think it's called storm chases uh, this is my first time playing the mode though super excited for this one i don't know a great deal about it i think it's pretty much you ride around on drift boards and you try and uh, impulse everyone into the storm and kill them. That's the only thing I think it, I think that's what it is. I think that's what I read. Uh, it's kind of similar to another mode that was in the game ages ago. Uh, but that one was you had to use weapons to kill people. Whereas I think this one is only by the storm you can get killed. So yeah, it should be a lot of fun. Uh, I've got the uh, the Beach Bomber skin on. been waiting for this skin for like two or three weeks. Whenever the 9.3 update came out and this skin got leaked as being in the game. Uh, I've been waiting for this one. This is like the one 14 days summer uh, skin that I wanted. I love the Bright Bomber and I'm so glad that I got it. It looks so good with this uh, drift board as well. It's an awesome full stop. I love this skin. Definitely one of my favourite skin in the game. And I think we should have a little bit of a dab while we wait for people to come. Oh, someone's here. Can we impulse them? Yeah, we can. Oh, it's pretty pointless because the storm was miles away. And I love this emote. I love this emote so much. So glad I hit T100 so I can get that emote. I think with that skin as well, the, with the Beach Bomber skin, it looks awesome. It just works so well, I think, those, uh, just the skin and the emote combination. Like, I think it just looks so cool. I think I'm just going to emote most of the game. That's going to be my plan. I'm just going to emote. Just keep out of everyone's way. Just chill out. Have a dance. And I think I think we'll be all good. I think we'll be all good. Oh, I didn't see move much there. Does... They move a lot. Does emoting... Does that not make you fly as far with the impulse grenades? That could be a strategy. That could be a winning strategy there. Oh, I've lost my drift board. Not good. Get back on it. Have I just found... If I just found the meta for this mode, just the e emotes and don't, you don't get impulses far, like, they, they, that could work. The only thing is you can't boost while emoting, you've got to stop emoting. This is a cool emote. Yeah, I, I didn't, I didn't get hit much there at all. I think I've just found the winning meta for this mode. This is a cool emote as well. Oh, they're doing the cluck strutting. Cluck and strutting, I can't remember what it's called, but either way, they're doing that one. But we're going back to this one. Love this emo, it's so cool. Oh, the T pausing. Oh, we might have to do that one. We might have to do that. Where's it at? There it is there. Yeah, I did not get impulse much there at all. This is definitely the winning meta of this mode. Just gonna emote the whole time. And I'm gonna get myself the win. Mount of words, we'll get ourselves the win just by emoting. Unfortunately, you don't go very fast when you do, so... Yeah, I've got to boost up hills. You can't go very fast when you emote, and you kind of just, like, go in, like... Like a drift mode, like, you just got the handbrake turned off kind of thing. You're just sort of rolling. I love this emote as well. This has kind of become, like, my new True Heart. Like, True Heart was my favourite emote for so long. Uh, but this is kind of, like... This is, like, the next step up. This is, like, better than True Heart in every way. Like, I love this one so much. But uh, we'll go for a little bit more t pulls. We're basically going to cycle through some emotes and have a good time. Uh, three people have already left the game. They've been lost in the storm. There's only nine players left. There's 12 to start with. Uh, yeah, so far so good. Oh, wrong way. The storm's coming in. 
Okay, there we go. We're good. We're good. Yeah, my strategy's working out pretty well. Literally just... Just keeping our people's weird. Just, just, just chilling out. You know, doing some emo and that, having a little dance, stuff like that. I think it's working out very well for us. I think it's working out very well for us so far. Except we're going to loot lake. Someone's fell off the drift board. They have. I was going to leave and be, though. We'll leave them to do the thing. We're just going to do our thing. We're going to tee pause all the way to a victory by how you mark my words. That is the plan. I think I found the winning meta for this mode. In my first game, I think I found the winning meta for this mode. I'm going to have to drift. I have to boost rather uh, because the storm was coming in there. But now we can get a little bit of laid back shuffle going on. I love this emote. I think this is potentially, apart from best mates, the best battle pass emote I think has ever been in the game. Uh, unfortunately, I don't have best mates anymore though because it was on my original account that I made. Oh, someone pickaxe me. You can pickaxe people in this mode? I did not know that. I think I've just found the winning strategy. I'm going to pickaxe people to death. It's time to get ourselves some elims. But yeah, I think best mates is the best E mode from the battle pass. I don't have it anymore, unfortunately. Because it was on my original account that I got when I started playing Fortnite. And this account, it, I made it in Season 4. So I've got my old account, but I don't use it. So this one's only got uh, Season 4 onwards skins in and E mode. So I'm missing out on the best mates one, which sucks because it is one of my favourite E modes of all time. But, oh, I did not mean, I did not mean to impulse myself. But that kind of worked out okay. We kind of um, we got quite close to the edge of the circle, so. But yeah, we can pickaxe people. I think it's going to be our winning strategy. I think it's how we're going to win the game. I know this person was plucking strutting and all that stuff earlier, but if I can pickaxe them to death, then I'm pickaxing them to death. It is what it is. But I'm going for the kill. Oh, I've eliminated someone. That must have been the person I pickaxed earlier. I must have finally got lost in the storm, so I got the elim. Nice. Yeah. Right. I have that person, Vapscallion, is that the name of that skin? I'm not entirely sure, I've never owned it, not a big fan of it. But either way, that person is back in the lobby now, not winning this one. We've still got time for a little bit of a dance of things, we've got five players left now. Two Elims. I'm going to go for the Vox skins. You never see a good Vox skin. Like, you get like the soccer skins, like sweat skins. But Vox skins are like always bot skins. I don't have ever come across a, a Vox player that is actually really, really good. I don't know why that is. I have no idea why that is. I actually don't like this skin anyway. I hate the face. The face just looks smug. And it just looks like a face you just want to slap. So uh, some people probably think mine probably does as well, to tell you the truth. But um, but yeah, I'm not a fan of the Vox emote. Uh, the Vox skin at all. But either way, there we go. Three elims. Three people left. Can we get this one as well? Oh, the impulse me just had though. But either way, we're good. Oh, we're going to the heart of Loot Lake here. Oh, I think they've, they've just boosted themselves too far. I think one of them's lost. Oh, the one's lost. It's 1v1. It's me and Vox. Man, I did not expect this from my first game. Oh, there we go. There we go. We've got time for a little dance now. We just won. Yeah, boy. Four eliminations. Man, that was my first game on it. And I got myself the win. And using the brand new Beach Bomber skin, which is so, so cool. This is probably one of my favorite skins in the game now. This is going to be a skin that I'm going to use a lot, you mark my words. So right, there we go, that is the brand new Storm Chaser mode. It's only about for one day, which sucks, it's part of 14 days of summer. And it is one of the best modes I think I've played in Fortnite. I love that mode, I would happily play that mode all the time. Like Horde Bush, I really enjoy that mode as well. I hope that comes back at some point in the future, same with Wicks Bounty. But yeah, this uh, these last few weeks at LTMs have been absolutely amazing. Uh, this one is awesome as well. I hope I can jump into some more games before it disappears. Uh, tomorrow, I think it will be like 2pm tomorrow UK time. I think it disappears for good. Hopefully, I can get some more games in by then. Uh, try and get some wins. It also counts towards your wins, which is awesome. A uh, good way to fluff up the stats for sure. Uh, you can't obviously can't get many kills, but you can get some wins of it. So uh, yeah, if you want to get some sort of Season 9 wins, some last minute Season 9 wins, definitely a good way to do it. Much like Hard Rush and stuff like that were as well. And um, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video today. If you did, make sure you give this video a big thumbs up if you're new around here. Make Make sure you subscribe with notifications on and as always don't forget to use code doodles in the Fortnite item shop and buying skins it really helps the channel a lot especially with the beach bomb skin being in the game today i know a lot of you guys are going to be buying it so if you haven't bought it yet and you're going to please consider using code doodles when doing so it will really help this channel grow immensely my name is Doodles. i thank you so much for watching and i'll see you guys next time